Hi guys, welcome back to the text in video series. In the last video, we have talked about the two commonly used text types in travel videos. One is a cinematic single title, another is a designable two-part title. And if you haven't watched that yet, click the link in the upper right to check that out. And now let's continue with this video. Today we are going to talk about the text layout and design that is commonly used in the fashion and the vintage look videos. And if you are interested in this one, keep watching. Do you still remember in the last video, we have mentioned that the sans serif fonts are frequently used for headings in travel videos, which would give the content a strong and a cinematic definition. But in a fashion video, the serif font would be more ideal, because it comes with the decor lines, which would make the text more elegant and stylish. Thus, we open video Vlogger. Click into the project we saved the last time. Import a fashion clip we prepared into the software, then drag it into the video track. Use split tool to cut out the unwanted content. Then let's start making the text part. Here we first click on the text icon in the toolbar. Adjust the duration to the length of the video. Then we go to the inspector in the upper right. Add the text content. Find a proper serif font for it. Reduce the font size to make it smaller as a subheading. Then click on the color box. Select the black color for it that goes well with the image. Click on the center icon in alignment. Use a show or high layer rectangle at the bottom to adjust the position to the top of the screen. Remove the shadow to make the header clear. We use a shortcut Ctrl C to copy it and paste it into the subtitle track 1. To create a harmonious yet contrasting look with the subheading, we keep the font attributes and the text color in Inspector. Then go and edit the new text content. Increase the font size. Widen the font spacing. Adjust the position in the preview box to make it cover most of the screen. This way, the layout can better direct the viewer's focus. At last, go to a text shadow area. Click on the color box. Select the white as a shadow color to brighten the screen. Then drag the slider to adjust the value. This can make the main header more designable. Let's preview the whole thing when finished. When creating a vintage look video, the head written text is also a nice option to go. This text font come out more dynamic and interesting than the serif fonts that we mentioned earlier. For example, when adding a title to this image, we can use handwriting. And with the composition of the image, we split the text into two parts to create a distinctive title. Let's add a text first. Drop down the font process in Inspector. Select the head writing font. Then click on the color box. Find the straw tool. Use it to absorb the yellow color in screen to make the color of the text match your image better. Then add all the attributes in the same way. Once it's done, we copy it and paste it on another subtitle track. 
Here we just need to change the text content and keep other attributes the same. And then, based on the idea, we adjust their position in turn with the shape in the frame as a center. Here is a preview. Does this inspire you in a different way? Alright, this is all for today's video. And in the next video, we are going to show you some ideas of how to design your text in a storytelling or content narrative videos. And anyway, don't forget to click that subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we will see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.